Hello, wayfinders, starseeds, and empaths. If you are over the age of 18, living in 3D, and you still have a sense of humor, you might be a sacred clown. If you laugh out loud at whatever you find funny, anytime, anywhere, with very little suppression, you might be on the Hayoka path. If you like comedies, jokes, and the unexpected, especially when used as teaching tools, you might be that sacred mirror of the gods known as Hayoka. If you're willing to play the fool, risk the haters, risk all judgments, and laugh in the face of your judgers, you might be a Hayoka. If you enjoy entertaining others, being a performer, living the life of an artist, art for art's sake, you may have chosen the path of the divine actor. Hey, okay, hey! If you think you're funny and your inner child is awake, you might be a Hayoka. And if you're willing to test that theory out on an unsuspecting public, uh, you might be a Hayoka. If you beat to the beat of a different drum, you might be a Hayoka. If you hear the drumming of the ancient shamanic heart of Mother Gaia and begin to dance and sing with the energies animating you, you might have tapped into your inner Hayoka. If you rewrite bad scripts and edit low vibe content for fun, you might be that sacred script flipping scribe known as Hayoka. If you see the coin and its obverse simultaneously, you might be that sacred mirror If you dwell in multi-dimensionality, wearing the stripes of the programmer, awake in the program, and co-creating the game in real time, you could be Hyoka incarnate. If you think of your world as a stage, a hologram, a simulacrum, of which it was well that you awoke from your avatar slumber, only to laugh, you might be a Hayoka. If you love people enough to show them 
themselves. You might be that sacred Heyoka mirror. If you respond to tragedy with finding that silver lining, no matter what, you might be a Hayoka. If you can go from concentrating the energies of multiple emotions like flipping channels on a remote you might be here as that sacred emotional clown friend if this ain't your first time at the rodeo You just might be that rodeo clown known as, you guessed it, Heyoka. If you believe that laughter is the best medicine, you might be a sacred clown. And if you can belly laugh like a Buddha, when all those around you are frowning. You, you my friend, might hold the frequency of the sacred laughing Buddha clown known as the Hayoka. And if you're not afraid to show off that ugly selfie because it makes you laugh. You might be a Hayoka. If you laugh alone in the woods, wearing feathers, you might be that sacred shaman known as Hayoka. And if you see the shadows on the wall of Plato's cave, while you're still dancing until you drop, you might be that sacred shadow worker connecting kids of all ages to their inner child, otherwise known as Hayoka. And if you've ever played the Harlequin, the court jester, the joker, the trickster, the juggler, the storyteller, the fool, you might be that divine psychonaut called to spread the cosmic joke. Don't take it all so seriously, my friends, for I am that divine clown known as Heoka. And if you've been activated into the language of light, you might be on the path of that sacred performer Fluffing the auras of the divine. Heoka. If you feel the energies of Callie dancing in all her aspects, you might be that wise clown who reminds all of the cycle of life, 
the gift of the Hayoka. And if you remember past lives as tribal leader, priest, priestess, outcast, outlier, the odd one, the black sheep, the autistic, the manic, the low-born, watermelon-eating, nose-picking, nobody wants to associate with or everybody does you're probably on the path of that sacred clown and if you're able to see the duality in yourself and in everyone you might be A wise clown and if you've ever been to the edge and stepped into the abyss reconciled you might be that sacred fool and friend if you've been on that hero's journey and felt a sense of completion of being at peace with the world you might be that holy Hayoka dancing in a wreath of victory and on your sacred ground and if you believe that life is the dancer and that you are the dance then you're definitely definitely on the sacred Hayoka path and if you think of life as a symphony a rich tapestry and a magnum opus of performance art and you are a player performer writer and co-creator of your own life then you might be that sacred dancer that Hayoka that happy dancing muse that rules the world